Good afternoon, everybody. It's Rich down along the river with Rich's River Smokers, West Virginia. Today, what we're going to do for you is what something I've always wanted to do is homemade barbecue sauce, but we're going to do it in a slow cooker. So again, I've always wanted to try this. We'll bring you in close and we'll show you what you're working with. All right, guys, what we're going to be working with today <clears throat> is we're going to be working with some water, some liquid smoke, using some of our ground red cayenne pepper, some chili powder, some Leo Perens Worcestershire, Worcestershire sauce, some mustard, and ketchup, which I don't have in the picture, brown sugar, lemon juice, black pepper, garlic, unsalted butter, apple cider vinegar, kosher salt, and some onion that we um, took our food processor and we find it, find it chopped. You'll see it right there. So we're going to go ahead and get this going for you. We'll see it back. Two cups of water, one cup of apple cider vinegar, one cup of Worcestershire sauce, one whole white onion, half a cup of yellow mustard, any brand of your choice, four and a half cups of ketchup. Here's two, the second two cups. And we're going to put the other half a cup in off camera. One and a quarter cup brown sugar, light or dark, your preference. Roughly four tablespoons of this in. That's four. Call you about four cloves of garlic. We're going to go ahead and use four tablespoons. We like a lot of garlic. Two tablespoons of unsalted butter. Two tablespoons of kosher salt. One. Two. Put two tablespoons of black pepper. One. And two. Two, two tablespoons of chili powder in. One. Two. I'm gonna spice her up a little bit with one teaspoon of cayenne pepper. Add Probably about um, probably a tablespoon of lemon juice, maybe two. And one, we'll go two. Three, or two, <laughs> two. That's about three. Two and a half, there. Two and a half tablespoons of lemon juice. One or two teaspoons of liquid smoke. We're gonna go ahead and go with two. What do you think, Miss Kathy? Sure. One. Two. Look at that. Got all of our ingredients in there. We'll give us a quick stir. Get everything all stirred up and ready to go. And we're gonna put this on low for about six hours. Everybody, now we got our ingredients stirred up, our cap on our lid on our crock pot is set to low. We're gonna cook that for on low for five, five and a half, six hours. And we're going to come back to you about two hours into it to show you what, the, what it looks like in two hours. And hopefully it's be hot enough for some awesome smells. Stick around. Sorry I misspoke. It was on high for three hours. So that's what we did. We're three hours in on high. And this stuff has took to a good boil. Now. So let's get a good. I stirred it once to. Ooh, look out. <laughs> I stirred it once to. Um, get that butter incorporated. We're going to stir it up. Look at that. Wow. It's coming along pretty good. So it's been on high for three hours. So what we're going to do now is cook it down to low for another two to three hours. Man, I tell you folks, we have an hour left on uh, low, we've been on low for two hours. Total cook time so far has been five hours. Be six hours and done, I think. Uh, man, this stuff is smelling phenomenal. So, as you can tell, we got a nice little hard cook in there. Getting rid of some of that, some of that ucky ucky stuff that makes some good flavor. <laughs> yeah, it's a ucky ucky. 
So we'll check back with you in an hour, in three hours. This is going to go have to go a little bit longer. It's not quite where we want it. Um, so, you know, I want to coat that spatula with a nice little syrupy coat. And it's not really, it's not really, you see the, the nice pieces in it, but you don't really, it's not really coating the spatula. We just, we want this to reduce a whole bunch more. So, apparently the recommendations I got from the people like there is a little more runny. I like mine a little more thicker. Let's go ahead and reduce this until we got it where we want it. It's been another hour. So, we finally have got what I wanted in the consistency. Check it out. What you want to see is covering the spoon just like that. I mean, the garlic, the onion pieces. So, we're going to cool this down and we're going to give you a taste. We're going to get this uh, into this half gallon jar and we'll give you a taste test. That barbecue sauce has cooled off and we have it in our one gallon um, mason jar. We're going to set that off to the side and let that thing pop seal. This is the remainder of it. Look at that. It's really turned out real nice. It's got a nice color. Coats the spoon. You get the chunks of the, some of the onion, the garlic. See the black pepper. It has a nice, nice tangy. You smell the spice. I'm gonna call this a kind of a bold barbecue sauce. So we did one taste test, but um, we'll do another one for you guys. Mm. Wow. Ooh. It's got some tang from that cider vinegar. Boy, it kind of hits you, makes your mouth water. It's bold, spicy, got some bang. Only sticks around for a little bit from all that black pepper and that cayenne. Really good stuff. If you want to sweeten it up, just add more brown sugar. This will work for me. A little spicy for the fam, I think, family, I think. But we'll, I think I'll go ahead and, and we'll enjoy this on some ribs or some chicken or uh, put it away for a special occasion. But anyway, this is how easy homemade barbecue sauce is in a slow cooker. So I think um, three hours on high, four hours on low, and this is what you get right here. Cook it to your consistency. Oh, this is gonna this consistent you're probably gonna be after guys I hope this video was informative to you helpful you can do anything in a slow cooker if you like subscribe hit that hit that uh, Weber Smoky Mountain hit that bell I'll let you know when I upload all my affiliate links and my social media will be in the description box hit show more give us a try guys share with your friends and family and when you do tell them the best barbecue comes from the river we'll see you on the next one